Well, now the Ravens have two quarterbacks who can be signed away to other teams if Ravens decide they don't want to match the offers that are given to them. Team, keep it clean. Freelancer in the building. What's up, baby? Tyler Huntley, who was the Ravens' backup quarterback and for a significant amount of this past season, he ended up needing to be the starter. And Tyler Huntley, who got to start his first playoff game, not playing his first playoff game, because remember, in the Bills game a couple years ago, he played in that game too. But anyway, Tyler Huntley, um, he was headed into this offseason as a restricted free agent. So uh, the Ravens, in order to keep him, at least for now, they will need to place a low round tender on Tyler Huntley. And they did just that today. But now, here's the kicker. Like with Lamar, we know that they placed a non-exclusive franchise tag on Lamar Jackson. So he can start talking to other teams in about 26 minutes from when this is being recorded. Because I'm recording this at 3.34. Depending on how the internet is acting, you'll see it sooner or later. Anyway, Lamar can start talking to other teams soon. And if the Ravens decide, hey, if, if another team offers Lamar a contract and the Ravens decide, hey, we want to match it so you don't go anywhere, they can do that. But if they refuse to, and if they don't want to, then they will get two first-round draft picks from that team. Now... With Tyler Huntley, it's a little bit different because with Tyler Huntley, with him being placed on off of the low round tender, um, then if a team decided they wanted to sign Tyler Huntley and the Ravens didn't want to match, they didn't get nothing. They get nothing. Tyler Huntley gets to go somewhere else and Ravens get not a thing. Now, as far as the money, um, it is worth 2.627 mil. Uh, that's, that's how much. Now, that's how much the, the low round tender is worth. I am not 100% sure uh, what the cap hit is on that. I'm not sure if that entire cap hit goes on the cap or if that's just the salary for Tyler Huntley. So I guess we'll have to find that out soon. But anyway, Tyler Huntley is still a Raven for now. Lamar Jackson. <laughs> I couldn't tell you. I couldn't tell you. I mean, I couldn't tell you, man. We're going to see we're going to see. It's like, man, today is just, today has been so crazy. And it, it just, it hasn't even been, we ain't even at four o'clock yet. Well, as of this recording, we ain't at four o'clock. By the time you see this, we probably going to be at four o'clock. Um, but yeah, man. So, oh yeah, yeah. My, my fault. Oh, you know what? I should start this whole thing over. Um, so the Ravens, they have, they, they now have two quarterbacks, two Pro Bowl quarterbacks. I can't forget that. I almost forgot that. But they have two Pro Bowl quarterbacks who can be signed to other teams right now. What what a what a off season, man. What a off season. And the off season is about it hasn't even officially started yet. But look at these Ravens out here making moves. Letting it be known who they are. Let's go, Ravens flock. Anyway, team keep it clean. I appreciate y'all. I love y'all and this freelancer, just like Lamar Jackson or even Tyler Huntley could be if the Ravens don't match any offers that they receive. This freelancer is...